I did geology for a year and it was really bad, right? It was so boring, right? Of, you know, all the excitement of the 19th century had gone. I stuck it for a year, but, but I really liked the people, both the, the undergraduates and the, the, the faculty. I got to know Drummond Matthews, because uh, he was in the same college as I was, uh, and, and also Morris Hill. And they said, we don't want to supervise you. Teddy Bullard is your man. So I, I then went along to Teddy Bullard and, and became his graduate student. Uh, and that suited me very, very well. He left me very much to my own devices. After I submitted my PhD, but before I was examined, I went to a conference in New York, which is a very famous conference, right, uh, which is called the History of the Earth's Crust, which wasn't really about the Earth's Crust at all. It was where all the new stuff from, from magnetic anomalies and earthquake mechanisms, Fred Fine was there, uh, Lynn Sykes, and it was quite clear then that the whole thing was essentially on, if you know what I mean. So I came back um, and in the three weeks before I was examined, I did all the work for what I regard as my first paper on plate tectonics, which was concerned with, with the thermal structure of spreading ridges. I went almost immediately after that to Caltech on the scholarship there and spent six months at Caltech, six months at Scripps, three months at, at, at Le Mont, Columbia, and three months at Princeton. And that was really when my education as a geophysicist right, uh, happened.